You must follow 10 eating changes after age 50. As you enter your 50s, it becomes crucial to adjust your diet and lifestyle to ensure you're getting the necessary nutrients for your later years. Our bodies change over time, and so should our dietary choices. Unlike your 20s, when indulging in donuts might not have been a concern, it's vital to realize that, as you age, such choices can significantly impact your blood sugar levels, increasing the risk of diabetes and heart disease. Furthermore, if you are diagnosed with health conditions that require dietary changes, it's essential to adapt your eating habits to manage and alleviate symptoms. Even if your doctor hasn't specifically recommended dietary adjustments, it's wise to proactively make some changes to your diet once you reach your 50s. These changes can play a significant role in promoting your overall health and well-being in your later years. Here are 10 healthy eating habits to follow at this age point. Number 1. Increase your consumption of complex grains. Substitute refined bread and pasta with healthier complex carbohydrates and grains like brown rice, quinoa, amaranth, buckwheat, and oats. These grains are excellent choices for your heart health, and they provide long-lasting energy for your brain and body. Complex carbohydrates found in these grains are like slow-burning fuel for your system, giving you sustained energy throughout the day. They also help keep you feeling full, which can be helpful for managing your appetite and weight. Additionally, the fiber in these grains is great for maintaining regular digestion. In simpler terms, these grains are good for your heart, give you the energy you need, and help with staying full and regular. By making this simple change in your diet, you're taking a positive step towards better overall health. Number 2. Enjoy fish. As we age, the risk of chronic diseases like heart disease, stroke, diabetes, Alzheimer's, and dementia tends to increase. However, there are steps you can take to reduce inflammation in your body, which is linked to these health issues. One effective approach is incorporating omega-3 fatty acids into your diet. These are considered good fats and can be particularly beneficial for your health. Omega-3 fatty acids are commonly found in fish, and including fish in your diet two to three times a week can provide you with these health benefits. Fish like salmon, mackerel, and sardines are excellent sources of omega-3s. If you're not a fan of fish or prefer plant-based options, you can still obtain omega-3 fatty acids from sources like walnuts, hemp seeds, and kia seeds. These plant-based foods are packed with these beneficial fats, making them a great choice for those following a vegetarian or vegan diet. In summary, as you grow older, your risk of chronic diseases may rise, but by incorporating omega-3 fatty acids into your diet, whether from fish or plant-based sources, you can help reduce inflammation and promote better health. Aim to enjoy these foods regularly as part of a balanced diet to support your overall well-being. Number 3. Keep sodium low. Maintaining a low sodium intake is crucial to reduce the risk of heart disease and hypertension. To achieve this, it's recommended to limit your daily sodium intake to 1,500 mg, down from the previous guideline of 2,300 mg. Lowering your sodium intake can significantly benefit your heart health. One helpful strategy is to cut back on using the salt shaker while cooking or at the table. Instead, Opt for fresh herbs and spices to season your meals. These herbs not only enhance flavor, but also do so without causing the bloating and health risks associated with excessive sodium consumption. Another effective way to reduce your sodium intake is by rinsing canned foods like beans or vegetables before using them. This simple step can wash away a portion of the added salt that's often present in canned products, helping you stay within your recommended daily sodium limit. In summary, reducing your daily sodium intake to 1,500 mg can protect your heart and lower the risk of hypertension. To achieve this, choose fresh herbs for seasoning, minimize the use of the salt shaker, and rinse canned foods. These small adjustments in your diet can have a big impact on your long-term health. 
Number 4. Eat high-protein foods. Obtaining enough protein is vital for everyone, but it becomes especially crucial for adults in their 60s and beyond. As we age, our muscles require an extra dose of protein to maintain strength and aid in repair after physical activity. The body's ability to use protein efficiently to build muscle decreases as we get older, making it even more important to ensure an adequate protein intake. Even if you're not yet in your 60s, incorporating protein-rich foods into your diet is a wise choice. Not only does protein support muscle health, but it also helps you feel full, which can be beneficial for managing your appetite and weight. When selecting protein sources, opt for lean options such as steak, fish, skinless chicken breast, and turkey. These choices are lower in saturated fats, which can be harmful to heart health. Additionally, you can boost your protein intake with plant-based options like tofu, lentils, and quinoa, which are not only nutritious, but also offer a variety of flavors and textures to keep your meals interesting. In summary, as you age, getting enough protein is essential for muscle strength and repair. Lean animal-based proteins and plant-based options like tofu, lentils, and quinoa are excellent choices to meet your protein needs and maintain overall health, even if you're not yet in your 60s. Number 5. Cook at home for healthier meals. Transform dining out into an enjoyable occasional indulgence while embracing the habit of cooking at home for most days of the week. Preparing your meals at home provides you with a level of control that's essential for crafting healthy, nutrient-rich dishes, and it helps you avoid the excess sugars, salt, and oils often found in restaurant fare. Here's why this approach is beneficial. When you cook your meals, you get to choose the cooking methods and ingredients. This allows you to prioritize health and nutrition. You can incorporate fresh, wholesome ingredients like fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains, tailoring your meals to meet your dietary needs. At home, you can sidestep the common pitfalls of restaurant dining, which can sometimes be high in unhealthy additives and excessive amounts of sugar, salt, and oils. By taking charge of your kitchen, you're not only investing in your health, but also in your culinary skills. Cooking can be a rewarding and enjoyable experience that fosters a deeper connection to the food you eat. In summary, making home-cooked meals the norm and dining out an occasional treat puts you in the driver's seat of your nutrition. It allows you to create healthy, nutrient-dense dishes while avoiding the hidden additives often present in restaurant food. This approach contributes to better health and a more profound appreciation for the food you consume. Number 6. Building strong bones as you age. As we grow older, our bone density naturally decreases, which makes it crucial to incorporate calcium-rich foods into our diet. This helps in building and maintaining bone density, reducing the risk of osteoporosis, preventing fractures and injuries, and keeping our bones strong and stable. For women, in particular, Calcium requirements increase from 1,000 mg per day to 1,200 mg per day as they age. One beneficial dietary approach to consider is the Mediterranean diet, which may also help lower the risk of osteoporosis. This diet emphasizes foods like fish, vegetables, moderate cheese consumption, and whole grains. It is notable for being low in processed and high sugar foods, which can contribute to better bone health. Excellent sources of calcium include dairy products like milk, cheese, and Greek yogurt. For those who prefer non-dairy options, fortified non-dairy milks can provide a calcium boost. Eggs and leafy greens, such as kale and spinach, are also good natural sources of calcium. In summary, as you age, it's essential to prioritize calcium-rich foods to support your bone health and reduce the risk of osteoporosis. Increasing calcium intake, especially for women, along with adopting a Mediterranean-style diet and incorporating various calcium sources, can contribute to maintaining strong and stable bones for a healthier, more active life. Number 7. Say goodbye to soda and sugary drinks. It's time to bid farewell to sugary soda 
and sweetened drinks, and welcome the refreshing choices of water and unsweetened tea. These beverages keep you hydrated without the drawbacks of a sugar crash, helping you maintain better energy levels throughout the day. If you're looking to make this transition gradually, here's a simple plan. Begin by replacing just one sugary drink with a glass of water each day. Gradually increase the number of sugary drinks you swap out for water, working your way up until you've completely eliminated them from your routine. This step-by-step -step approach makes the change more manageable and sustainable. To make hydration even more accessible, keep a reusable water bottle with you throughout the day. Refill it regularly, aiming to take a sip every hour or so. Having water readily available encourages consistent hydration and helps you break the habit of reaching for sugary drinks. In summary, by swapping soda and sugary beverages for water and unsweetened tea, you'll not only stay hydrated, but also avoid the energy dips associated with excessive sugar consumption. Gradually making these shifts and keeping water at hand can help you build a healthier, more refreshing habit for the long term. Number 8. Eat colorful vegetables and fruits for healthy aging. When it comes to your meals, a simple but powerful strategy is to seek out a variety of vibrant colors to adorn your plate. These colorful foods are typically packed with a range of fruits and vegetables, and they offer an array of benefits as you age. Bright and colorful produce like greens, oranges, reds, purples, and yellows is particularly beneficial. Why? These colors often signify the presence of antioxidants, which are like your body's anti-aging defenders. Consider including foods like berries, sweet potatoes, leafy greens, broccoli, bell peppers, melon, eggplant, beets, and squash in your diet. These items are not only visually appealing, but also rich in essential nutrients that help combat the effects of aging and support your overall well-being. In summary, by incorporating a colorful array of fruits and vegetables into your meals, you're not only making your plate visually appealing, but also enhancing your health. These vibrant foods, with their abundance of antioxidants, can be your allies in the quest to age gracefully and maintain good health. Number 9 eat when hungry to keep metabolism active. Balancing your eating habits in your 50s is essential for maintaining a healthy metabolism and overall well-being. It's not about eating mindlessly all day or consuming large portions at every meal, but rather paying attention to your body's hunger cues and responding appropriately. Eating when you're hungry serves a dual purpose. First, it nourishes your body, providing it with the essential nutrients it needs to function optimally. Second, it helps keep your metabolism active. As we age, our metabolic rate naturally decreases, meaning we burn fewer calories while at rest compared to our younger years. To counteract this, it's a good practice to keep your metabolism fired up throughout the day. One effective approach is to eat every three hours or so. This means having regular, balanced meals and incorporating healthy snacks when needed. These smaller, more frequent meals help maintain a steady metabolic rate and provide your body with a continuous supply of energy. In summary, eating in response to hunger cues, along with maintaining regular meal intervals and healthy snacking, is a proactive way to support your metabolism and overall health as you enter your 50s. It's all about nourishing your body and ensuring it has the fuel it needs to thrive. Number 10. Eat whole foods for better health. For your overall well-being, it's a wise choice to focus on consuming whole foods. These are foods that are as close to their natural state as possible, and they can be either fresh or frozen. Examples include fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, fish, and whole grains. Whole foods are rich in essential nutrients that support your health. While fresh and frozen whole foods are great, it's also convenient to include minimally processed whole foods in your diet. Examples of these are canned beans and yogurt. They offer both nutritional value and ease of preparation. Conversely, it's a good idea to limit your intake of processed foods. Processed foods often contain high levels of sodium, added sugars, 
and excessive calories. These can be detrimental to your health if consumed in excess. By reducing your consumption of processed foods, you're taking a significant step toward better nutrition and well-being. In summary, for optimal health, prioritize whole foods in your diet. These are unprocessed or minimally processed foods that provide essential nutrients. Whether fresh, frozen, or minimally processed, like canned beans or yogurt, these foods support your overall well-being. Reducing the intake of processed foods with added sugars and high sodium content can further contribute to better health. To maintain health after 50, commit to a balanced diet rich in whole foods, lean proteins, healthy fats, and fiber. Decrease sodium and added sugars to mitigate health risks. Ensure sufficient calcium and vitamin D for bone health and stay hydrated. Regulate meal and snack times for stable energy. Minimize processed foods and be mindful of portion sizes. Listening to your body's hunger cues can aid metabolism. Alongside dietary changes, prioritize consistent physical activity to manage weight and reduce chronic disease risk. Remember, individual needs vary, so consult a healthcare provider or registered dietitian for personalized guidance and make these changes with a focus on your own health and well-being.